guys, it's Queen Bija, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 10 of Cells at Work of Black. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Mind you, it is now like 3.41 in the morning. I am tired as hell. Um, <laughs> even though I slept most of the day away, but if you see me yawn, I am sorry. Your girl is hella tired. And still got, like, one more thing to do after this, plus editing shit. So I might have to drink another, like, one of these before I finish everything. No, you need to slack off. You've been working your ass off. But something's gonna happen. We all know that. But like psh, the last three episodes that we have with this episode, the show, not counting episode ten. I mean, but oh no, this is the episode where it kind of seems like his friend's gonna die. Oh fuck, it's about to be depressing today. Mm. I can't imagine if he dies in this episode how, you know, our male red blood cell is going to take this. Because that's his friend and he's been friends with him possibly for like... Ooh, excuse me, sorry. Um, Maybe ever since they've been kids or since they've been born. So having someone that you really care about for such a long time... And not having them in your life anymore. That's going to make you feel some type of way. Yeah, I'm definitely going to go get something to drink after I'm done watching this. Bro, it's going to be 6 in the morning soon and I'm still going to be fucking up. Oh my god. Oh. <sighs> But I gotta get all this done by 10. Oh. <laughs> oh the bookie. You could go apologize if you want. Oh. <laughs> now Thank you. 
Oh, well, at least y'all got some special suits. I thought he was just gonna be like, nah, fuck it, you just gonna go out there like this. Oh, damn. I don't think so. I mean, this is really, really bad. Like, I mean, yeah, everything was bad, you know, from episode one up until now, but this seems hella bad. Oh my god, come on. Even at three in the morning lights? You're getting fixed tomorrow morning. Today, really. <laughs> oh. That's the way. Yeah. The body?
And it's okay to be scared. Everybody's scared. Bro, that's it. <laughs> nah, nah, I'm about to say KO. This ain't no KO. This some game over shit. Mm -mm, that's it. <laughs> Press that button. Go to hospital. Time of death. 1100 hours. Oh God, it's getting worse. The fuck was that? The same little disgusting as fuck. Lights, I swear to God, you are going to be fixed in less than so many hours. Please stop. You're going to be off all damn day until like 5 o'clock in the afternoon. Shit. Hell, they might even have to sacrifice themselves. This body might not have any more white blood cells after this. You have to. What else can you do? You don't just want to stand here until it's like way too fucking late, don't you? Just be careful though. Just be okay.
But can you stand on it though? I mean, y'all ain't got anything else besides swords. I know swords do some ish, but see, if y'all had some guns, a chainsaw, I don't know what else. I mean, grenade launcher? Yeah, grenade launcher. Hell, I just finished right watching that high-rise invasion, so <laughs> you need some weapons other than a damn sword. Hurry, hurry. Oh, come on, get up, get up, get up. So fucked up. I thought in that episode he would have died, but come on, are you serious? I was thinking if that because he got saved, he would have been okay. This is fucked up. Like, oh my god. If only that antibody came so much earlier. Well. Mm -hmm. 
You can be like this day in and day out. This some bullshit. This some real bullshit. No, he only has white blood cell, though. Yeah. For baby. Oh. Hmm. I mean, of course, because he's depressed. He lost his best friend. Like, you fucking serious? Like, oh my god, I was assuming that he was gonna be okay after the episode, the caffeine episode. You know, him being close to death that, you know, he got a redemption arc and that, like, by the time we got to the end of this damn show, he would have been okay. <laughs> this show is like, nope. Let's just thank God I ain't read this chapter because I think if I had to read this chapter, oh, to keep this a secret for a couple of weeks, oh, I don't think I would have been able to do that. I would have been a high-ass mess every time he would have puffed up on fucking screen. Red, Red has no one now but White Blood Cell. His best friend, his best fucking friend is now dead. 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 He's not coming back. That emotion that he had trying to like wanting to save him and everything at the end of the episode, how him getting depressed. He's depressed now and that hurts. Like, he's been such a happy baby after everything that's happened. But to lose someone who he's cared about for the longest time. I, I, I don't know. I, 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 mm, Jesus, whoa, God, because I don't think you could, because, of course, depression is not like a, you know, a, it is still a sickness, of course, but it's more mental illness and everything. Um, it would have been weird if they did something on that, but really to see, I think to see, you know, red blood cell and more of a depressive route and white coming to the rescue, of course, like always, because of the fact is who else is going to, essentially come to red blood cells um aid except white blood cell because they've always been with each other no matter what even though he's had his best friend up until this last episode of him officially dying but like i oh god the fact that he's now gone and it's just his friend it's just him like it's fucked up because of the fact that they've been together since the beginning and i was like okay we're gonna get a pass on these two because they're both technically main characters but which shows like this um and especially whether it's funny or not but it's still to the point where characters are slowly dying one by one yeah you can't always hope and pray because your designated favorites are always gonna die in the end and then next thing you know everybody is dead and then you're like damn what the fuck am i supposed to do now but oh uh, i just need white to come and comfort him and tell him everything's gonna be all right even though it's not going to be all right because losing someone like that is hard and i don't know how he's gonna go through with it but other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 10 of Cells at Work Code Black. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Thursday for episode 11. Bye, guys.